How's it going, guys? What's going on? It is KBGB's Gordon here. And yeah, so we got the stock drop in Veer Holy Pandas. So these aren't OG handmade ones. These are drops answer to that. I do have the parts to make them. Um, I actually decided to have the newest Holy Panda, the black ones. Holy Panda X, HPX, HP10, with a Halo stem, a Halo true stem. That's personally my favorite out of all the pandas. Let's see, let's do, uh, let's do a one page test everything. That should be good. 10 minutes. Yeah, there's not any background music. So. I'll do my best.
27 words per minute with 94% accuracy. Uh, spent 9 minutes and 6 seconds typing all that. It's pretty good for being blind, if I don't say so myself. Alright. So that's that. Uh, that's how these keys sound. Pretty good. So, stock holy pandas are not bad, especially when you have, for the most part, tuned stabilizers. Especially that space bar. Love it. And I love the feeling of the holy pandas, they're very nice. For one of those switches to where, um, honestly, I'm really excited to uh, try out a modified HP X10 with the old school uh, stem in here. So I get that nice clack going on. Very nice. Love it. Let's see. Uh, get a GMK keycap. Grab one of these. So I can make a comparison. So the originals are, well, at least the drop originals are definitely thockier. This is more of a higher pitch on the sound frequency spectrum. More of a bright clack. So if you like that kind of marble um, typewriter sound, This is uh, this is your switch. So try that out. If you have any of the HPX, the Holy Panda Tens, even with the stock springs, just throw one of these Halo Truth stems in there and uh, say how you like it. it. Makes it a little bit more tactile. It's not as smooth. And personally, it's the best version of the switch. Um, this version, you know, the HP Ten. So I guess it's a, uh, not sure how I would describe that. Cause it's, um, I don't even know what to name it. So guys come up with a name for me, for this switch. OG stem, then uh, new housing. So, yeah. All right, that's it for the video. I am going to start getting some new lighting 
and some extra cameras so I can start doing other angles and then do editing. For the first few videos, I'm not editing. I'm not doing anything like that. I just kind of want to go straight through and uh, show it like it is. And I'm not sure if that's exactly the way to go with things in the long run, but it's the kind of content that I want to, you know, do at this time. So I appreciate you guys. Thanks for stopping by. I'll start updating my videos so that there's timestamps on what I'm doing, what I'm talking about, and everything, and all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, so eventually I'm going to upload a video of these nice and lewd. I'm not going to use Crytox because that would be a bad idea. I'm going to use the uh, 3204 right here. Let's see if it'll focus. Are you going to focus? There we go. 3204. InfiniKey. So if you guys like InfiniKey's products, I highly recommend them. I'll put a link to their, uh, to, well, all the websites where I got all of my stuff. Mass Drop for this, Mass Drop for the keys, the switches. Um, I believe it was QED fans for the tofu going on here. Brass plate. That's probably what I should have mentioned. So I got a brass plate in here. I got plate foam, PCB foam. Uh, I did a holy mod on the stabs. These are Duroc screw-in stabs. So uh, they go right into the PCB. I have washers on them. So yeah, no, it's very nice. And I like it on the dust mat. They do have little rubber feet for this model. I did not get them because I like it laying flush. It just feels nice. I feel more of the, um, how should I say this? Uh, the sound, you know, frequencies, the vibrations and that kind of stuff is absorbed and released into the pad. So it gives a really nice sound. Anyways, that's about it. This is taking long enough. I'll put down the other things so you guys can just skip through to the parts that you want to see. All right, that's it. This has been a good experience. I do have an Instagram now, so I'm going to be starting to post as much content as I can there. Um, I am going to be a little bit busy, but I will start consistently at least posting once a day, uh, several things, you know, at once. So yeah, and starting to do some shorts. Um, just for the heck of it, I decided to use that rave song that's been going around. and I thought it turned out kind of funny. So check out those links, have a nice day, nice evening, wherever you are, much love, and yeah, peace out, and see you next time, bye-bye.